welcome to Luna Logic Tarot. I'm Juju, and this is going to be a bonus reading for Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising. This is a bonus as a way for me to say thank you for all your love and support of my channel, um, of my content, and all your to thank you for all your love and, and your continued love and support. I really do appreciate you guys a lot. These are very general, so take what resonates, leave the rest. If it's not your story, do not try to make it fit. Everything is subject to free will and the will of the divine. No one is free from law of cause and effect. So let's see what's going on. Let's see. Show me Aquarius, please, for November 2021. What's going on for them? Problem solving. Capricorn just had this, too. Oh, mind games. Okay. If you're figuring out someone's playing mind games with you, you were warned. You were warned that someone was fucking with your head. You were warned. Okay. You, oh, was this you doing this, Aquarius? You get what you give? Oh, okay. What else for Aquarius? Accept it. Deal with your shit. Your, your person. Look, as I split the deck. Got deal with your shit. And then on the other side, it says your personal issues. Okay. You need to put your phone down, pay attention to what the hell's going on, on going on around you. So basically here. You're getting some type of karma. Because you need to it's gonna force you to deal with your personal issues and personal shit. You're now starting to heal. You realize you need to heal. You need to start dealing. Or this is someone around you. Maybe you said this to somebody too. Someone said you get what you give. You or you get what you get because and accept it or deal with your shit. Because you warned them. Either you were warned or you warned somebody about their mind games here. And to, so for someone to deal with their shit. And they didn't. So now they get what they get. Because you're figuring out the mind games here. Okay. Sorry, Cross Watcher. I am going to read it from Aquarius' perspective. But the, obviously the rules can be reversed. Okay. What's going on, please? Let's see. Let's get some more cards here. Oh, let's see. What's going on, please, for my Aquarius? What's going on for my Aquarius, please? Okay, death card, Scorpio energy. There's an ending here, for sure. There's an ending. Yep. Hermit reverse. Someone, you're ending something with somebody because they didn't learn their lesson. Virgo energy. Someone's, someone's repeating mistakes of the past and keeping a lot of secrets. They've talked to a lot of people at night. You're ending it. You're finding something. You're finding the truth out. And you're ending it because someone's talking to somebody at night. It could be a Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, a Virgo energy. Or possibly an Aries, Taurus, Leo. you got four majors. This is a big deal, Aquarius. This is a very big deal. You're ending this. You're done. Oh, my God. You have five majors. Judgment. You're making a final decision here. Somebody here has, is keeping you a secret or keeping a secret about an Aries, a Taurus, or a Leo. Um, and you're, this is your final decision. you got Scorpio, Sagittarius, Scorpio here, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Someone, someone that learned from the past. Someone is talking to somebody at night behind your back. Yep. You could be talking to a masculine Aquarius right now. And you're, you're ending it. Yep, you're taking action to end this. There you are. You're taking action to heal for your wishes to come true here. King of Pentacles Reverse could be dealing with a Taurus here. Somebody is very jealous. Someone bribed you or someone is conning you. You're moving away from this. Chariot. You're moving away, you're moving away from this pretty quickly. Yep. Yeah. Someone was trying. Someone had a lot of options here. Someone was creating a lot of confusion for you. Taurus, Libra energy. This person is not stable on their own. This person is very jealous. This person is not possibly good. You got a husband and a wife here. Husband's in their in their power right now. So Aquarius, you could be the one who's doing all this crazy stuff. And okay, and your husband's in in his power, or you know you could be out of your power right now because you're very jealous. You're very um, spiteful right now. Not being a good partner, or you know. And your person is walking away from you. Or you're in your power and you're walking away from somebody because this person created a lot of illusion. This is the card of mind games and illusions and confusion on purpose, deception. Someone, a Taurus Libra here, wished 
wished to create confusion in your mind and they did just that you're moving away from this person you're leaving them if you haven't left them yet you're about to leave them now yeah this is someone that you maybe you have children with or that you maybe you wanted children with this is someone you've known for a long time you're very nostalgic about this person or this person's very nostalgic about you ten of cups in reverse this is not a happy family this is not okay what i just noticed take seven from ten right you have what three cups this person had a third party this person had a third party Mm -hmm. Cross watcher, you could have a third party. Okay, or Aquarius, maybe you did. Someone's leaving though because of that. Yeah, yeah. Someone was re someone was reluctant to heal things with you or see things from a different perspective because they have a third party. Someone is not working. Okay, someone stabbed somebody in the back one too many times, and now they're no longer willing to work with them. We got Capricorn, Pisces energy here. We have also got. Aquarius energy here, also Gemini energy. Someone here got stabbed in the back pretty bad multiple times. Someone is done playing, allowing someone to play with their mind. There is a jealous woman here, a very jealous woman here who's not stable on her own two feet, who wished, who took the action upon their wishes to create confusion in your mind. Yeah. You're at a crossroads. you got to make a decision about what it is you're going to do about this. Someone here likes to play a lot of games. Someone was married and messing around with somebody else. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, period. Someone was married and, and had stability and had everything that they wanted. And this would be illuminated to, to you. You're getting some type of lightning in, intuition or it's being revealed to you. They were playing around with you. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. They played a lot of games with you. Someone was not who they claimed to be. Like the whole time. Ooh, spicy. This is spicy reading, but you're ending it. You're ending it. Mm-hmm. Let's see who you might be dealing with. Let's see. Spirit, who, outside of the signs I've already said, who could Aquarius be dealing with? Okay, we don't have Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising. A Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising. A Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising. Anyone else? Anyone else, please? Oh, this one to come out. Gemini, sun, moon, rising. Bomb and deck, we got Taurus. I'm going to take it. And Aries, I'm going to take it. Let's see. Let's see. All right. So if you're done with a Virgo, Spirit, what is Virgo's intentions towards Aquarius, please? What's Virgo's intentions towards Aquarius? I'm going to take the two to flip. This person is not a stranger to you. This person is moving towards you. You know this person. This person or this person that they're moving towards is not a stranger. You know this person. Okay, if you're dealing with Sagittarius, this person has a lot of questions for you or they or you have a lot of questions for them. Okay, yeah. Someone wants to, you, okay. This Sagittarius wants to ask you a lot of questions about why something ended. Okay, or this question, this person's got a lot of, or somebody here wants to, Okay, a Sagittarius doesn't want you asking them any questions about something. If there's something that they will not talk about, if it's a friend, if it's their phone, if it's their activity or who they're talking to, they don't want to answer. They want you to stop asking them questions about that because they're hiding something. Aquarius. Okay, show me, tell me more about the Sagittarius' intentions towards Aquarius on purpose. Oh, this one flip out. Tower. Yep. So they're trying to avoid a tower here. All right. If you're dealing with a Pisces. Oh, that one flipped out. Yeah. The home in reverse. This person doesn't want to come home. Mm -mm. Yep. They're not going to fight for this either or fight for you. If you're dealing with a Gemini, what's Gemini's intentions? Uh, they're very vain and arrogant here. Oh, they could be also very beautiful. <sighs> the message in reverse. This person doesn't want to communicate with you. Mm -mm. If you're dealing with a Taurus, what's Taurus's intentions? They don't want anything to grow with you. Mm -mm. This person, the sage in reverse, this person does not want to grow anything with you. This person is not, this is Virgo energy. This person is not learning from their lessons. They're repeating past mistakes over and over and over again. I feel like you're understanding that. This person is no sage here. This person oh, doesn't, okay, this person doesn't want to be a father or they don't want to be a mother. Mm -mm. Which is okay. That's totally okay. Um, but somebody here doesn't want... Okay, they don't want you to be their dad. 
but they do not they're yeah the body here this person does not want you to have their body they don't want to have sex with you and why that why is that no they do not want to have sex with you okay well, that's their choice right okay what else about this course peace they no peace the full in reverse. This person was very, very careless here. Oh my God, with libido. Bottom of the deck. This person, they are, they are, they will bring you no peace here. They will give you no peace. They don't want anything to grow with you. This person is not growing. They're not evolving. They're repeating past mistakes. This person was careless with their sexual libido. This person might have a sex addiction. Yep. If you're dealing with an Aries, what's Aries intentions? This person is a snake and they're very arrogant and cocky. Careless, arrogant, and cocky. Look, the peacock, okay? The, the the libido here with the snake. We got the full reverse. They could have been messing around with an Aries. Ooh, this Aries is a liar. Yes. And now in reverse means they have been a liar in the past here. They're also lying to you about money. Um, they're saying that they don't have money, but they do. This person, this horse is very, very arrogant. And very got addictions. Bad. Okay. Let me get some guidance. All right. What guidance do you have for my Aquarius, please? Okay. We get a house, a sign, and a planet. So these have messages and then potential actions you can take. So house, planets, signs. Okay. So let's see. We have Saturn. So this talks about lessons, karmic lessons. We have in Taurus. And we have... The eighth house, which is Scorpio's eighth house. So you could be done with a Taurus, could be done with a Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, or Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising. Or you could have in your chart. So, but there is a Taurus here could potentially getting their karma right now and their lessons. It says the maturity that brings, so these are your messages, the maturity that brings resources to maintain personal power. Caution regarding the practicality of the mysteries of life. Limits imposed resulting from the productivity of a major change. Yep. Then you also have be realistic about your beliefs as a life or death issue. Be concerned about the cost of getting and using power. You must wait before you can use the most direct way and use other people's resources. Yeah. All right, Aquarius, take it for what it is. You know, apply yourself where it fits. If not, don't cross watch your same thing. Damn. Okay. Whew. Yeah. All right. Well, if you want to get a personal reading with me, that information will be actually the one we get one more. Anything else, please, for my queries? Anything else for my queries? Anything else, please, for my queries? All right. Let's see. It says some good shit is about to happen. Don't let your issues fuck it up. Make better choices. Make better fucking choices. You are pissed at where you are. Then stop taking yourself there. Yep. Alrighty. Also, bottom of the deck, they told me to look. Stop talking. Shut your mouth and listen. Okay, but I also feel like you need to stop talking. I just feel like you need to stop talking to this person. But that's up to you to decide. Okay? Alrighty. If you want to get personal reading with me, all the information will be in the description box below. Please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And hit all notifications. That way you know the next time I upload. And as always... Aquarius, take care of yourself. Until next time.